£100,000. That's a lot of money, right? That's how much over 2,500 council members across the country currently take home, according to new data released by the Taxpayers' Alliance. It's all part of a town hall rich list which has been released and it shows that more than 600 employees earn more than the Prime Minister. 2,500 town hall employees earning more than £100,000 despite tax bills going up and local services being cut. The report shows us data on how many members receive more than that 100,000, but it also shows us that compared to other regions, members in our region are less inclined to hit this pay bracket. But does this necessarily mean we get more value for money? It's a waste of money as far as councillors are concerned. I think they should cut a lot of their, their allowances that they get and they should go back into the actual sort of community. Well, I just think they get far too much money, the councillors, and there's so much need to do in the town. You know, I don't think it is appropriate at all, really. As you say, so many things have been cut at the minute, how difficult it is to get a hospital appointment, to get to see a doctor and things like that. I don't think it's appropriate, no. Does it shock you that that many people, you know, are paid more than the Prime Minister? I think it is. I think it's quite surprising, really. Yes, it is shocking, yeah. yeah. It's ridiculous paying them more than the Prime Minister. I just don't think they represent value for money. The same to have lost the way and the priorities have gone out to the window. It's self-preservation all the way along the line. Many councils say that wages like this are necessary if they are to attract the right calibre of talent. Do these numbers shock you or do you think these wages are justifiable? You can let us know what you think using our Twitter, WhatsApp and of course our email address. Will Fox for North East Live in Seal.